And this is a model of the HMS Burford, supposedly around 1722. Yeah. The, um, the model that you're looking at is very special to us. And uh, it's very it's historically significant just based on its age. It's about 300 years old uh, wow. since it was built in 1722. And wow. the, uh, the HMS Burford that it's modeled after was also built in 1722. It was uh, the, first, uh, the second Burford. The first one was built in 1679. It ran aground in Italy and then it was rebuilt in 1722. The fascinating story behind this ship is that the commanding officer of the ship was named Admiral Edward Vernon, and underneath him he had a midshipman by the name of Lawrence Washington. And Lawrence's younger brother George went on to become president, but that's a separate story. <laughs> and uh, but after after uh, Lawrence Washington uh, went back home to Virginia in 1740, he decided to name the family estate after his commanding officer, Admiral Vernon, and as such we get Mount Vernon. So he had admired. Admiral Vernon quite a bit, and uh, decided to name the estate in his own line. Uh, uh, other than that, uh, it is completely original to when it was finished in 1722. Wow. So this model was made in 1722 as well. That's amazing. It's classified as a third-rate ship. Uh, it's outfitted right now with 64 guns. It, did, it was outfitted with as many as 68. You have a second-rate ship above this one. It could hold about perhaps 80, uh, the, uh, seven, or 80 guns, rather. And uh, first-rate ships could hold even more, upwards to almost 100 guns. Wow. Wow. Well, I definitely have to put this on YouTube. That's great. That's gorgeous. Yeah, that is just such stunning detail. Well, everything is just, you know, it's so tiny. And you yes, to, you know, it's, uh, it's designed And even the exactly. painting is... Yeah, it's uh, exactly to scale. Every, every detail has not been overlooked. Wow. Uh, from the rope ladders off the sides to the, uh, to the images you see mm -hmm. along the sides. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of recurring themes on this particular ship. If you look on the, uh, the gun covers, mm -hmm. uh, you'll see an image, an image of a lion. It says, More here on the HMS Burford. I'm just now noticing that anchor that's about the same shape as the one out there. Yes, uh, the anchor that you see outside is um, likely have come from a British warship, either from the Revolutionary War or the War of 1812. Not entirely sure. Yeah, uh, but, but that anchor looks exactly the same. And then there's another one there. Mm -hmm. 